Hey guys, welcome to my channel. As no contita today, I'm going to show you how to make this flower balloon design. So if you want to learn how to make it, stay tuned and keep on watching. To make this flower arrangement, you're going to need two of these twist balloons, size 260, a hand pump, some scissors, and five five inch balloons. So to begin, we're, we're going to, oh, and a ruler. I like using a ruler. Um, so to begin, we're gonna blow up these um, twist balloons, which I already did. I think that's pretty simple. You just blow it up, tie it, and make sure that you leave some space in the end. All right, here's my other one. See, I left some room here in the end. And as you twist, because as you twist, the air starts moving down here, so that's why we need that space. All right, so we're gonna start by making five, five petals, right? So here's my ruler, and I'm gonna make sure that every petal is nine inches long, all right? Nine inches. So there's my five inches, and then I'm going to kind of fold or make a crease, and then twist about three times. Then I'm gonna take this end here, if you can see that, and I'm gonna push it through so it comes out the other, the other side. All right, so just give it a little squeeze here so the air flows nice and measure my other nine inches. Do the same thing. Make sure they're nine inches. And twist. About three times, all right. And then we're gonna do that here one last time. Nine inches. Twist here. And then we have three little petals, like so. And now we, I'm gonna cut right here. Cut this end here. And I'm slowly going to release the air. Once I've done that, I'm going to tie a knot. And that secures, make sure that, um, now make sure that the air doesn't um, get released. All right, so now we have this one here. I'm gonna take take this balloon, take my ruler, and measure another nine inches. Once I do that, make sure it's nine inches. Yep, and fold again. One, two, three times. Do the same thing here with this head here. All right, and give it a little squeeze. Nine inches. And twist. And we're gonna do the same thing with this end. We're going to cut it. And release the air. And tie a knot securing the balloon, making sure that the air won't escape at all. So once we have, well, if that happens, just tie it, I guess I can say. Just make sure you tie it. There we go. So once we have these two petals, this petal here, and these three petals, what we're going to do is put them together, all right? And all we simply do is just 
hold on to the um, a petal from one pair or one side, not one pair. This is three, and the twist. Now we have our little flower. Five petals, all right? So we're going to set this aside. And we're going to start blowing our five five inch balloons. So we blow, fill, I mean, fill our balloon up. And I want this balloon to be three inches, all right? So I'm going to release about three inches and a half. I'm gonna release. Okay, that's a good size there. And I'm not going to tie it yet. I have to wait. So what I'm going to do is my trick. I kind of wrap my fingers around this here. Hold it tight, okay? Hold it tight, and then I blow, and I fill up my balloon with air. And I don't have to use a ruler anymore. I mean, you can if you want to, but now I'm gonna guide myself from the first balloon that I um I blew, all right? So I make sure they're the right size, the same size. Right, they are, and now I tie them together. Like so. I'm gonna put that aside. Well, keep actually keep it nearby. Since we are guiding ourselves. So remember we're guiding ourselves with these balloons now. Make sure they're the same size. Right, they are. Set it aside. Take don't tie this balloon yet. Fill this balloon with air. Make sure they're about the same size. Okay, they are, and now we tie them together. And for this last balloon that we have here, I'm going to fill it up. Make sure they're about the same size. And this balloon here, we're going to tie it here, all right? go tight it now what we're gonna do is put these together all right and it's pretty much the same thing what we did that we did with the other long petals the twist balloons all we're gonna do is I'm gonna take one balloon from this side here and then take one balloon this balloon up here and I'm going to Twist them together. And there we go. Like that, all right? Now this next part can be a little bit tricky because now we gotta combine these together. Gotta put these together, which is sometimes can be a little bit tricky. So what I like doing is I like setting that one down, okay, then I'm going to take this one here on top and then take this petal and then just give it a twist, okay, and do that with like two or three more petals, like so, see, and now they're Combine, they're together. So now we just have to adjust our little flower. So what we do now is um, make sure that we have a purple petal, blue, purple, blue, then purple, blue, and so on. So here I already have a purple, blue, purple, blue, purple, blue, purple, blue, it's 
Christy, like so. And then kind of push in these blue balloons, kind of push them in, okay? Give these a little squeeze inward. And the same thing with these, okay? Give a little squeeze. I'm gonna turn it around. Do the same thing. Just gotta adjust the balloons. So now what we're going to do, I'm going to set this aside all right. Remember this piece that we cut off the excess from these purple balloons? So what we do next, I'm going to stretch. Stretch this balloon out and fill it up with air. All right, there we go. Fill it up a little bit, not too much. Maybe about that size, which is, if I use a ruler, it's about two inches, okay? Two inches. And I'm gonna tie it together, all right? Tie the two ends together. Like that. Like so. And that's what we want. Okay, now this little piece here, we're gonna cut that off. Don't cut this long piece off, just that little tiny piece that was hanging on the other end. So now what we're going to do is place this in the center. You see that? And With this here, we're going to twist around one of the blue balloons, all right? Twist, like so, and then release. And then just hide that little end there. And there you have it. And you can do the same thing back here, all right? And there is our flower. You guys can use this um, flower design on bouquets, on balloon columns, balloon arches. That's totally up to you. And remember, you can totally use different colors. That, um, all depending on your theme, you can use a blue, purple, or pink. That's totally up to you. There's so many colors that you can use. Well, you guys, thank you guys for watching um, this tutorial. I hope you liked it and you enjoyed it. Enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to like my video, share, and subscribe. And um, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos. Well, thank you guys for watching. Until next time.